guys welcome back to my channel so today I have uh, an updated skincare routine video for you and um, some of you may have seen my um, follow me around uh, for the Dr. Hauschka event I went to in February I guess it was and if you've seen that you know that it had to do with skincare so um, first of all I want to say that I got gifted uh, my entire skincare range from Dr. Hauschka so thank you Dr. Hauschka and I have been using them for um, well over a month now like from the start of February until now so that's well it's a pretty good time to form an opinion about skincare so there we go so I got four items and one item is a secret item yet because it is not for sale but we will get to there later let's start with like step one of your skincare routine so your first step would be cleansing milk uh, to remove all of your makeup and this is the cleansing milk by Dr. Hauschka and this is a very very soft and smooth cleansing milk it's uh, suitable for sensitive skin and well I don't really have sensitive skin but I do have sensitive eyes and I also use cleansing milk to remove my eye makeup so um, yeah I didn't get eye infections or whatever so that's pretty nice and also um, the lotion and all of their products like Dr. Housecare is a very natural brand and the main ingredients of this cleansing milk are yojoba uh, I hope I pronounced that right in English and there's almond oil in it and well the smell of these products is so different it's just it's so natural and when I first started using it my boyfriend was like you smell weird they all their products kind of have a weird smell but uh, over time it kind of grew on me and now I really love it and I find my other uh, care products really um, chemical and stuff like that so the next step in the skincare routine from Dr. Hauschka is this um, face lotion and they have a normal face lotion and they have a face lotion special and I have the special one because that's for oily skin and I do have oily t-zone and like a normal rest of my face so I picked the, the special one and this one calms down oily skin so uh, and I believe the main ingredients were calendula and hold on for the rest I need the box all the ingredients are on the boxes that the products came in um, the main ingredients of this face lotion are entilis calendula and nestrusium nestrusium I guess it soothes redness and it minimizes the appear of blemishes well I really like this face lotion out of all the products I think I am the most fond of this face lotion because um, the feeling and it's a spray actually and the feeling when I spray this on my face is so satisfying oh it kind of you know I, I get the feeling that my skin really calms down and another plus of this face lotion is that it is also a makeup setting spray so you know face lotion and setting spray like yeah and this product also has a very natural scent and the spray I hope you get an impression of the spray of me spraying here but it's a very fine mist so um, not like the Fix Plus, the Fix Plus kind of has a, um, a harder mist with larger like drops that land on my face and stay there. This is a really fine mist. Uh, the only downside of this, but maybe it's the packaging, is that um, kind of the nozzle, I guess, gets um, blocked very easily. So you need to clean this regularly. And then I have this day cream and this is the Melissa day cream and this also calms down oily skin and contains rich hazel and well this smells like lemony flutter from Lush exactly very lemony although I like this cream this is my um, least favorite out of the products that I was able to try because um, if I apply this in the morning then uh, my Studio Fix Fluid from MAC um, will not apply as nicely as usual so I actually only use this one when I know that I am not going to wear makeup for the rest of the day because um, then it gets the whole day to kind of sink into my face and um, won't make my makeup messy 
so maybe this cream is just a bit too greasy for my face or it is just not the right one and then the product everybody was waiting for well actually i don't know if he was waiting for this but this was the product why um like the event i went to was organized and this is the night serum and this is a new serum they already had one but not specifically for night time and um this one is and one of the most important ingredients of this one is apple now this is a product i need to tell you about when i first started to use this my skin felt very kind of tight like the only way to explain it is um like if my skin was doing this like please give me some nice night cream please like you know the feeling but in the morning my skin was like super hydrated and fresh and you know i just could feel a difference and um well at night it was so super uh, tight and and not comfortable and then when i woke up it just it feel it feels very good and then I read like the um, the message that came with this product and it said exactly that so um, what it does uh, overnight your skin kind of repairs yourself and this product um, helps with that the lovely ladies at Dr. Hauska they told me that this was enough for your skin and that your skin is able to do so much um, itself but kind of we make it lazy with all the creams we apply it's actually the same principle with uh, like lip balm if you apply lip balm over and over and over your lips kind of get lazy and can't uh, do it without the lip balm anymore so that's kind of the same idea and now of course the big question how did my skin respond to this well at first I thought well how much of a difference can like a more um, high-end skincare make to my face because I never really tried it and um, my uh, old skincare as you could see in my previous routine video was from just low-end products so you know I thought well let's give it a try I have the product and um, yeah well weeks went by and then after like three four weeks I started to notice that um, you know I get a lot of pimples like randomly there's always like one somewhere and I started to notice that um, although the pimples and red spots didn't disappear that the rest of my skin which was just like normal skin uh, like on my cheeks it started to look nice or something and um, my foundation went on smoother and looked better and you know uh, my skin doesn't feel really dry anymore if I step out of the shower you know that very dry and itchy feeling like I need to apply cream that really disappears and I don't really have that anymore so um, I guess my skin now is hydrated and although it is still greasy at the end of the day it looks better overall and it doesn't really help my pimples to not come anymore but you know it just looks nicer overall and as you can see I am pretty low on especially the cleansing milk so I will need to repurchase this soon because I definitely know that I will I really like this and I almost forgot to tell you more about the night serum it's not on sale yet but it will be at the 1st of May but uh, I'm allowed to talk about it now so that's why I did my updated skincare routine so I hope you enjoyed this video and if you have any like further questions or whatever just leave them down in the comment box and um, I will link down some extra information about uh, Dr. Hauska or wh whatever where to find it uh, etc down below as well and I really hope that you are having a lovely rest of your day and I will talk to you guys very soon bye bye Thank you.